sweetheart, I don't think there's any way that anyone, even Marty, could hate you. Hmm. Well, I didn't think it was possible for anyone to ever hate you, but somehow Dorian manages to pull it off. No, Dorian doesn't hate me. Dorian is resentful. She's unbelievably competitive. And she she's jealous sometimes, that's all. Marty hates me, Mom. And it's okay, you know, I get it. You push someone hard enough and eventually they snap. Natalie told you I was pregnant? Let me guess. Roxy went running to her and Natalie felt she should break the news. No. Apparently she found out by accident. By accident? Of course it was an accident. It's always an accident with Natalie. Oh my God. Because she didn't mean to kiss you. She didn't mean to ruin what should have been the most important moment of our lives. God help us if she ever does anything on purpose. There's been some tension with Marty for obvious reasons. John. Yeah, and I've been trying to avoid her. You know, darling, I don't really care uh, what Marty thinks of you. I care how you feel about this baby they're having together. Apparently, she saw the pregnancy test. How? Was it in your purse? Yes, it was... Uh Yes, it was in my purse. She was looking in my purse? No, she didn't know it was yours. Bree accidentally knocked it over. You left it in the foyer at Vicky's. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. You know what? How about we stop talking about Natalie and we start talking about you and me? I'm thrilled for Marty and John. I mean, having a baby is a, a wonderful thing, and John's going to make a wonderful father. You're not a little disappointed? You did seem to be reconnecting with John lately. John saved my life. So we've been spending a lot more time together. But, uh... It's nothing that would threaten John and Marty's relationship. That was never gonna happen. Especially if I leave the country. Why would you leave the country? I could tag along with, with you guys and take, help take care of Bree. I mean, I, I could really use the R&R &R in London. Oh, honey. Whatever you need. <sighs> Sorry. You just caught me off guard. I know the feeling. The person I wanted to hear this from was you. Why the hell didn't you tell me? What happened when Rex was born? He was just a little baby. He couldn't do nothing to help himself. Roxy, uh, are you saying that someone took Rex away from you? Right on the money. Who? Allison Perkins. You're gonna do the right thing, or I'm gonna do it for you. What are you, what are you gonna do? Rex, are you gonna break in here, steal the baby out of her crib? Get a grip. You know what? Get out of my house. Okay, I'm not going anywhere. You and Stacy and Kim lied to me and Gigi for over a year. It's time to make amends. I'm not giving her back, Rex. So you can just forget it. I'm her father. You and Gigi have no claim on her. Alice and Perkins? It's a real kick in the teeth, right? She's the one who took Rex away from you? After she delivered him. Alice and Perkins delivered your baby? I didn't ask her, believe me. She was so excited because Mitch Lawrence was the father. She had to be there the second the baby was born. And she was. We were all alone in the cabin. Like you and your sister. And I went into labor early. And my little baby was as sick as a dog. Just like little Sierra. And he needed help. And the only person that could help him was Allison. I don't, I don't get it. Skyler's Sierra's father, so he takes his daughter home. What's the problem? Maybe the fact that Skylar Joplin is a drug addict and a thief? But I'm just guessing. If Gigi wants to come by and work out some kind of arrangement, then she can come and we'll talk. You are not hearing me. Joplin, there's no arrangement. 
Sierra goes back to Gigi. Who the hell do you think you are? You don't make decisions for anyone around here. Not me, not Gigi, and not Sierra Rose. You had your chance, and you blew it because you slept with Stacy. So did you. Yeah, and it's my kid. So you don't get to waltz in here and try to score points with Gigi by threatening me and my child. That's all you care about, huh? Keeping score? Yeah. Yeah, and I won. Because Gigi dumped you. She dumped you? Oh, she'll be back as soon as she finds out you can't deliver. You son of a...